وأنا أقول لك أن أنا 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 We're concerned in OFDA are partnering together to address the issue of severe water shortages. Since 2010, they have rehabilitated 90 water points in three regions in Somaliland, reaching over 45,000 people. <laughs> More recently, World Concern has been involved in activities relating to disaster risk reduction. Capacity building communities with the skills and knowledge they need to be better equipped to respond to the recurrent droughts and floods which come their way. Additionally, they are involved in livelihood diversification, providing just under 3,000 IDPs with seeds and tools for agricultural activities. Together, Well Concerned and OFDA has been able to save lives and reduce human suffering and has built a platform for continued programming around water supply, improved environmental practices and disaster risk reduction for pastoral communities. When World Concern started working in these communities, people reported using just 2.7 litres of water per day for all of their basic needs. <laughs> Providing water in these communities has so many impacts. It enables women to spend less time collecting water, giving them opportunity to do more productive activities. It protects women, meaning they're less vulnerable to attacks on the way as they go and search for water. It means that children spend more time in school. Additionally, water can be used as a source of income for people who have to look after the water supply points. And overall, it means people are not dying of unnecessary preventable waterborne diseases. <laughs> In the last four years, World Concern, partnering with OFDA, has worked in 27 villages in Sul, Sanag and Togda and has been able to improve the lives of over 45,000 people with improved access to water supply as well as additional livelihood strategies. However, in the context of climate change, adaptation strategies are necessary in order to be able to build resilience and allow communities to adapt to increasing recurrent hazards. Drought and climate change are inevitable, and responding to these on a reactive basis is not sustainable. Building on work already done and successes learned and working closely with affected communities, our overall goal as we look ahead is to empower them with knowledge, resources and external linkages, enabling them to be better prepared so that if and when another drought occurs, the impact is less, less lives are lost and less people suffer.